So I guess when it comes to the types of actions that can be taken for maybe people that are non-technical, uh, would they be able to trigger something to happen on chain? Basically, what you have mentioned is the power of smart wallet. It allows a dual control model. Basically, the users own the smart wallet, but we have the granular access control that allows AVA protocol to trigger something to act on their behalf. We can call that permissions. For example, mm -hmm. you can say, I allow AVA protocol to act on my behalf uh, uh, against these smart contract wallet addresses. Basically, one EOA wallet, your wallet, your MetaMask wallet, or even Coinbase wallet can create as many smart wallet as possible. And you can use each smart wallet to control one action, one scheduled oh, payment. To me, the true unlock is when you build an application that relies on a unique piece of infrastructure and those two things put together actually bring you a differentiating product to market. And I think that what you all have here is essentially an example of that.